Hi YouTubers, Jeff Cote here with Ask PYS. We've got a question from a fellow boater, uh, Tim. Tim asks, I have an older Grand Banks 52 Europa that has original lighting. It throws off a yellow light and draws a fair amount of power. I would like to upgrade, but not where to start. Do I have to remove all the wiring? Do I need new fixtures or just bulbs? Tim, that's a, it's, it's an excellent question because all of us as boaters, especially if we have an older boat, are gonna have what are called either halogen light bulbs or incandescent light bulbs. And those live bulbs, if you bring your hand close to them, is, are generating a crazy amount of heat. And that heat is a loss of power. So as a boater, one of the first things that I always encourage fellow boaters to do, especially when they're talking to me about having not enough power and doing solar or adding batteries or a wind turbine or high output alternator and all these different ways of creating more power and storing it, one of the easiest things that every one of us should be doing is at least replacing, replacing the lights that are incandescent and or halogen on our boats, especially the ones that we use all the time, the one in the salon, the one in the galley, right? Start with those and replace those with LED lights. Now the trick is, a lot of times, and there's so many different LED uh, bulbs or lights that are, op are available, what I recommend boaters to do is to buy a bunch uh, from different manufacturers and to try them. So buy five, buy six, buy a dozen, buy three. Try them out, In invite everyone that has a say on your boat, that comes boating with you. Might be your partner, might be your friends, and ask their opinions. Hey, do you like that light? Is that a yellow enough light? Is it too white, too blue? Is it too cold? And basically try it in the fixture, and once you like a certain light, some of us like yellow lights, some of like us more white lights, blue lights, have a look, try it, and then once you're going, yes, I love it, then pull the trigger and then replace them all. So the trick when you're replacing uh, these incandes incandescent or halogen bulbs is that most of the cases, we don't have to replace the fixture and certainly not the wiring. We just in, in actually end up replacing the LED itself. So we'll actually take, it's called a G4 halogen bulb, We'll remove it and it's got two little prongs and we're going to replace it with a G4 LED version. So the, the replacement it can be pretty straightforward. The trick is to do your research, find a light that you like, and then pull the trigger and replace them all. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please ask it below or use our contact form on our website. Support us to keep this channel ad free. Happy to donate my time because I'm a boater too but help us offset the cost of doing these videos by donating via PayPal or potentially buying some of our merch on our store. And don't forget to subscribe uh, so that you can keep having these weekly and we're producing almost four videos a week now. And thanks again for watching.